Hello everybody and thanks for stopping by and watching another Palm Mash TV. We're glad that you could join us again today. And uh, as again, as I've said the last few episodes, we've really been having a lot of interviews lately. Probably the most I've done, I, I don't know, I think ever. But but uh, we're glad that uh, you're able to stop by and uh, I think you're going to enjoy this interview a lot. And uh, uh, we'd love to hear from you. Uh, so if you're a fan or even just a singer that sees us and would like to be on the show like I said just as always just stay tuned for the closing credits and everything will be available to you right there uh, this time from Nicholasville Kentucky we have Bruce Smith another country music singer on the show and we'll be speaking with him for a few minutes so without further ado let's talk with Bruce Smith right here on Paul Mash TV well, hello and welcome back to a brand new interview here on Palm Mash TV. And with us from Nicholasville, Kentucky, we have Bruce Smith. Thanks for joining us, Bruce. Thank you for having me. Okay, yeah, it's no problem. Um, uh, I think the obvious question that uh, I ask a lot, and uh, uh, that's uh, how, uh, what caused you to be a musician? I mean, I'm sure you've loved music ever since you were a little boy or uh, maybe just fell into it. I mean, everybody has their own story, so why don't you just tell me your story? Well, my dad used to sing in bands in South Florida, and uh, we used to play the guitar around the house. I turned about 16 and decided, I'm going to get a lot of nerve up, but I'm going to sing. <laughs> uh, we went to a gong show, and I got gone, but uh, oh. we had a good time. I mean, uh, it, learned me, it taught me a lot, so from that point on, I just kept on going. Oh, I see. Um, was it was that the the one with Chuck Barris? No, it wasn't that one. <laughs> it was in a little bar in South Florida called the Huddle Lounge. Oh, okay. Well, you know that there was a game show called uh, the Gong Show, and uh, Chuck Barris was the host of that for years. Oh, I remember that show. Alan yeah, Jackson came from there, I think. You know, uh, I, that was I, Mexico I, Network. Yeah, I thought maybe that was the one you were talking about. Of course, they just uh, rebooted it not long ago, but it didn't last very long. I think Mike Myers was the host of it, I think. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, of course, he didn't go by that name, obviously. But <laughs> um, let's see, uh, what, what would be your biggest influences? I mean, obviously, you're a country musician. I'm sure a lot of country musicians influenced you. Maybe you could name some of those for us. Well, you got um, the Hag, Merle Haggard, George Jones. Hank Jr., mm -hmm. Waylon Jennings, you know, a lot of them. Yeah, yeah, that's a good list. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, go ahead. There's a lot of good ones back then. We used to listen to a lot of um, Johnny Horton around the house growing up. So a lot of haggard. Right. Yeah, yeah, those are the oldies but goodies right there. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I, yeah I, li I liked a lot of them myself, so. <laughs> yeah. Um. Now, I, I don't know if you have any albums are out or not, or if you're planning on coming out without with any albums, excuse me. Uh, maybe you could uh, talk to us about that. Well, I got one song out called You Have Stolen All My Memories, and I'm working on another one called Take My Heart. And mm -hmm. we are coming out with an album, working on it. Um, we're hoping to get it out around June, but um, you know how that goes, man. <laughs> mm. Yeah, Hopefully and, it'll be out around June or July anyway. Oh, okay. All right, you talk about the album? Yeah. Oh, okay. Doing an uh, album of tribute to uh, Mr. Ed Gowans. Ah, uh, okay. Passed away last year. Right, so yeah. Doing, a song that he, doing an album that he, he wrote a bunch of good songs, and I got lucky enough to, to get a chance to do a tribute to him. Well, that's good. Um... Yeah, and speaking of that, uh, Stolen All My Memory, I think you said was the name of the song. Uh, we're getting ready to play that in just a minute. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit of a story behind that song? Is there anything uh, you'd like to say about it? Well, um, Donna Reed told me to check it out. So I checked it out, and um, I really like the song. It's upbeat and sort of like an old Ray Price tune to me. <laughs> but uh, I really liked it. All right. Well, uh, we're going to go ahead and play that right now. But before we do, I just want to thank you again for uh, stopping by and being on our show. And uh, we'd love to have you back sometime. Like you said, you're coming out with that album later on in the year. Maybe we can have you back so you can plug it for us and 
Maybe we can talk about other things that are going on in your life by that time. So uh, if you're interested, maybe why be back? I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. So here's uh, Stone All My Memory by uh, Bruce Smith right here on Palm Mash TV. You are the one I dream of as I lie here every night. Your face is always with me as the dark turns to daylight. I was holding you last night, dear, for a fleeting moment in time. Then it all began to fade. As the day began to break, then you stole my memory from my mind. I have always loved you right from the very start. You have stolen all my memories and found a place here in my heart. When we spend our time together I thought we never part You have stolen all my memories And found a place here in my heart I hope someday we be together But I know that can never be There are bridges between us You care for him and not for me So I'll just keep on dreaming Of how things used to be I'll still hold you in my mind And remember when you were still here with me I have always loved you right from the very start You have stolen all my memories and found a place here in my heart When we spend our time together I thought we never part You have stolen all my memories And found a place here in my heart You have stolen all my memories And found a place here in my heart 